We got some more cat food in the mail today. I'm really excited about this. I had never heard of this cat food until I had read Liz Eastwood's um, F Natural Flea Control book. Um, she, at the end of it, talks about foods that are good to feed your um, cat and you can um, request a list from her and so I requested the list and got it and this food called Lotus was on it and so I was curious to try it out and the company was generous enough to send us some so um, they sent, I asked for enough cans for, I like to get two for each cat. And um, so I got two for Charlie, two for Trig, two for Murphy, and two for Camus. So here's one of their foods. This is their grain-free chicken and vegetable pate. And then they sent us. their grain-free turkey and vegetable pate. We think, Gassy. Oh, that's so exciting. Thanks for sending my, I like the boxes always the most. Sorry, kid. And then, last but not least, <laughs> they're both in such a playful mood right now. Um, we got the grain-free salmon and vegetable pate. So I'm going to open up one of these and see how they like it. Uh, you know, and eat, we're going to review each flavor individually. And in each um, review, I'll include the guaranteed analysis information as well as the ingredients. Um, this is really important for cats, for cat food, that it doesn't contain these ingredients. Liz talks about that um, on her Natural Cat Care blog. I'll include a link to Liz's um, blog post where she keeps an updated list of um, foods that are good to feed your cat. So let's open it up and see what they think. What I don't show on video a lot but something that I always do is I allow them to smell it before I serve it to them. What is that gosh? Oh look in the chops, look in the chops. You think, Mom? Oh, it's a chop liquor. It's a chop liquor for that one too. Oh, yummies! All right, I'm gonna dish it out. Oh, I'll give you a close up. So that's right after opening up the lid. Okay, so I've dished it out and I'm about to deliver it. I know. So we have so many options over here. Ready? Here you go. We gotta be trying it. Oh, that makes me happy. That makes me so happy because that means we don't have to eat crappy food. I gotta tell you that I struggle with the whole cat food tobacco as much as everybody else does. I wish it wasn't hard. I wish that there was some sort of organization in place that really kept an eye out for the cats rather than an eye out for the money makers. Oh, that makes me so happy that he likes it. Hopefully Charlie will too. I'm gonna put the bowl over there and see if he'll go for it. What do you think, Bubba Boo? Let me try that out. A little elevated bowl right there. What do you think? <laughs> um, no. I'm gonna have to walk away from that. That doesn't mean anything though sometimes. <laughs> This makes me happy. Oh, this makes me happy, Jake. Oh, look how much you are to eat. <laughs> He's like, she's going to pet me. I'm going to walk away. So we're going to do um, a full product review on each one of these flavors of Lotus Cat Food. And that one, that flavor that Trig was just munching down on is their salmon and vegetable pate for cats. 
I'll include a link to Lotus's type, uh, Lotus's website so you can see all the products that they make. They make dog food as well. I'll also include a link to all of our product reviews. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. If you'd like to learn about cat products, please consider subscribing to our channel on YouTube. Thanks so much for watching.